We're located in Roanoke, Alabama, just on the Georgia-Alabama line. We've got, give or take, 100 plus acres of, of sod total. So we're small, still growing in that. Going into 18, I did start noticing some small areas, mainly in our, our zoysia fields. It, it really started to become a real yellowish tint. It's not the green that we were looking for. I upped the, the nitrogen. Obviously, that's the first thing you know you want to do. It wasn't doing the trick. It just whatever we tried, it just wasn't it wasn't enough to change anything. When you have to start skipping around a field to pick and choose what you can and can't harvest, it gets real challenging. Once I met Zach um, and knew his background, I knew he could probably bring a lot to the table, which in fact he did. He came out and, and as I said, he did soil tests and he, he felt like we had a sulfur issue from the get-go. He explained in real detail to me on how sulfur kind of gets overlooked. So like I said, we used thysol. It immediately, within two days, took the yellow one out. Not only that, we used it on the whole farm and, and saw huge results throughout the entire farm. I mean, everything was is just greener. It grew better, it was healthier. It, it made a huge impact on what we were doing. Another big thing that we've noticed um, through Crop Vitality products is we have actually been able to harvest multiple fields twice in one season, which is almost unheard of for the area we're from. And that's huge. Now we use three products, KTS, Thysol, and Insure. That's been a real good blend for us so far. I'm excited about growing more because, uh, as I said, it's, it's, it's gotten better and better every year. I mean, it's, it's really changed the way we, we grow turf.